Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another brand new Android Studio tutorial. And today in this video, we are going to just implement a alert dialog in our Android application. So we have seen a lot of application using the dialog to show whether you have to make the changes. And if so, then you can press the OK or so. Uh, otherwise, you can press the close or exit or something like that. We have also seen the mostly we have seen the dialogs when we press the back button and uh, it will be showing that do you want to exit the app or not so in this video we are going to add a alert dialog in our android studio and inside our android application so let's jump into the android studio and i have an empty activity what i'm going to do is simply adding a button so that when the button is pressed we can add the alert dialog going to the text we have the ids button everything same i'm just going to the main activity and i'm adding the reference for the button inside it now i'm adding a one click listener for the button so my button said one click listener and new one click listener so for the allow to dialog i'm going to create a new method so that we can easily call it inside the inside the button click listener or anywhere else we want so that i'm just going to create a new method on the name it as private void then show alert dialog and you can give any name as you wish now inside that we have to start using the alert dialog so alert dialog we have to add the alert dialog dot builder so we are going to access the alert dialog using a builder so adding the alert dialog dot builder and I want to give a name for the builder as my builder or something like that my builder then equal to new alert to dialog builder so alert to dialog dot builder and the context that is going to be main activity dot this so if you're writing it inside a fragment activity then you can replace the main activity dot this with get activity or view or something like that now we have to access the items or the attributes of the alert dialog using the builder that we just created so my builder dot set title and I want to give a title as my dialog message or a dialog box and next and just I'm not closing it so that we can simply add it again set positive button then positive positive button or positive comma now one click listener that is going to be new one click listener I'm selecting this method and blah I'm adding a toast message so that we can understand what it actually going to do so positive clicker now I'm adding a second thing that is set negative so set negative button then new one click listener same as this I'm just copying this pasting it here this time positive into negative now closing it and now what we have to do is that we have to also again create a alert dialog with the name alert dialog itself equal to then using our newly created builder we are going to create the alert dialog and finally alert dialog dot show okay now we are ready and finally we have to call this show alert dialog method inside the one click listener of the button so show alert dialog and that's it now let's go and try this in a real android device okay guys so we have the android app in the android device and we have a button with the name button itself and when i press the button you can see we have the alert dialog with the title as my dialog box and also we have two buttons and when I'm pressing the positive button blam you can see the toast positive clicker is here and when I'm pressing the button again and selecting the negative right now and you can see negative clicker so hope you guys got the idea and if you like this video then give it a big thumbs up as always thanks for watching and I hope to see you in my next tutorial